Hello friends, kids and bone health. As parents, we all have to take that extra interest in taking care of our kids so that uh, you know, their, their bones are stronger and as they grow up, they, they grow as strong individuals. The skeletal system, right, which is made up of the bones and joints, it is the foundation of any human body. So I think we should know a few basic things, how we can take care of our kids so that they grow into strong individuals. Number one, please expose them to 30 to 40 minutes of sunlight every single day because sunlight is the main source of vitamin D and uh, we all know that calcium is an important uh, you know, mineral which is important for bone growth. But for calcium to function more efficiently in your body, vitamin D is very, very important. Secondly, their diet. Make sure their diet is rich in calcium. When we think of calcium, we blindly think of milk. Milk is not the only source of calcium. I agree, milk is a source of calcium, but try to combine some non-dairy sources as well. For example, some sesame seeds, some sesame oil, green leafy vegetables. You'll be surprised. The amount of calcium in green leafy vegetables is phenomenal, especially broccoli, celery, or any kind of spinach, any kind of green leafy vegetables. And uh, you know the other sources again, like walnuts, almonds. So combine dairy and non-dairy sources as they grow up. Just don't rely on only on milk to, to meet the dairy demands of calcium. Thirdly, a very important thing, please engage them in some kind of weight-bearing sports. What do I mean by weight-bearing sports? Uh, for example, something like badminton, jogging, where there is some running, some activity where there is constant jumping, for example, basketball, volleyball. See, when you, when you engage kids in these kind of weight-bearing activities, there is positive stress to the bone, which increases the osteoblastic activity and makes the bone stronger. So please engage them in any of these, any of these activities. And lastly, one very important thing, please reduce the intake of sugar in, in all forms. It can be candies, chocolates, you know, desserts, in any forms. Because sugar has got direct correlation in, in reducing the cellular architecture of the bone or it affects the cellular architecture of the bone. So I'm not saying avoid sugar, please reduce the amount of sugar you take in. We hope these tips help your children grow into healthy individuals. Thank you.